Hello guys, I'm coming back with another tutorial. Uh, this is just a quick animation that I use a lot on my videos and intros and client projects. Uh, it's a quick tip from FX Channel House and I uh, hope you enjoy learning some cool things. We're going to learn how to make these exploding lines and uh, also how to animate some shapes. So let's get on to our tutorial. Okay, uh, welcome to this quick tip. Uh, I'm going to show you how to animate these uh, exploding lines and uh, then you can use it on your animations, on your videos or whatever you want. So uh, let's start our quick tip. So hit up a new project, new composition. Uh, I'm going to leave the size for 1280 by 720. It's cool. Uh, I'm going to leave the frame rate for 30. Okay, so um, uh, let's hit up a, a new solid, um, uh, just a background, just in order for us to see better the, the animation and the shapes. Uh, onto our our video so okay uh, once we have our background uh, let's hit up uh, a pen tool I'm going to click I'm going to hit shift and then hit again so uh, once we have that uh, we have our our shape um, ready for for animation and this should be very very easy to do uh, and this is just a quick tip so you go you're going to learn a really really nice effect here on uh, Adobe After Effects so uh, hit up uh, trim pads and let's animate these trim pads so uh, in order for this to animate uh, cool we're going to mark uh, our place over here and then I'm going to on the start we're going to put this on 100 I'm going to click the stopwatch I'm going to move this a little bit forward like one second about I'm going to bring this down and um, the animation uh, gets set so um, we have our spline like growing and staying over here so we need now to do, do to do the reverse in order the um, the line uh, works like an explosion uh, so on the end uh, we're going to leave the um, we're going to start on 100 we're going to click the stopwatch over here in the middle then we're going to push this a little bit forward we're going to bring the the percentage to zero so we should have our animation now going so yeah we have our spline that is growing and disappearing like an explosion that's okay it's very easy uh, the animation so what what you're going to do now is just to make a full rotation and copy a lot of um, <coughs> sorry a lot of uh, shapes uh, in order to this gets like a like a ball explosion or something uh, similar. So what you're going to do now is going to press R and then you have the rotation. You're going to click on the stopwatch, uh, then press Alt and click on stopwatch. Okay, we should open the expression tab. We're going to write uh, index uh, like star. I'm going to put 360 bar 20. It should be a cool rotation for us to, to start. Now it's very simple. We're going to to control control D and uh, you're going to press uh, how many times you need to to get like a full rotation. So I'm going to make it a few ones until I have the full rotation. More one. That should be cool. Okay, we have the full rotation of the explosion with the exploding lines. In a f and like just in a, on a few steps, so this is a very nice um, effect to learn here on After Effects. Um, it's a really really cool program to learn. So hope you enjoy it. But we're going to do just one thing for you to have um, a more just a more knowledge on, on these shapes. You're going to you're going to uh, grab all the layers. You're going to Put layer, pre-compose, move all attributes, okay. And then on the comp size, we have already everything like fixed and um, our layers are really, really not messy. So um, now you can scale it up, scale it down. You can uh, bring in some colors, uh, whatever you want, you know. Um, you can bring it, uh, you can make a lot of changes in here. So. All the layers are fixed 
on this on this pre-comp and uh, you have all this thing organized so this is a, a my quick tip and i uh, hope you enjoy following this and i uh, hope you enjoy learn um, this effect so i will come um, back for more with some more cool tutorials on this and i uh, hope you like it so peace